Back in April, Randy Carver's family says he was diagnosed with dementia, and days later he was reported missing to the Holden Police Department. He was last seen at the Circle K on Route 1. Police are saying due to the extended time period that Randy has been missing, there could be cause for concerns. Uh, we've had many missing people over the couple of decades You know, I've been here. This is a little unusual to have somebody not turn up somewhere roughly a month later. Chief Greenlee says three different police agencies are assisting in the ongoing search. There have been drone searches, local hospitals have been checked, and surveillance from the store Randy would frequent has been viewed, but police are still asking, where is Randy? Well, we certainly do feel hopeful. We are very much hoping that he appears somewhere and he's okay for his own sake and, of course, that of his family. Uh, with that said, it is unusual. He, he appears to have left pretty hurriedly, and we've searched all over. Police are asking for any tips to help in the investigation of this case. Anything at all that would be helpful if they've seen someone that looks like him. If you've seen the picture, he's pretty distinctive with the fa face piercings. That's probably going to stand out for people. So if they have any idea that they've seen, seen someone like him or they think it's him, the Holden Police Department certainly wants to know. The Carver family encourages everyone in the community to be on the lookout and call the authorities if they see anyone matching Randy Carver's description. In Holden, A.J. Douglas, ABC 7, Fox 22.